Hey, what's up guys, it's CK here, and um, today I'm not doing the q and I'm doing my Final Cut Pro X, or aka Final Cut Pro 10, um, tutorial, like an editing tutorial, so this, this, this is actually my first tutorial, tutorial that I'm making. And it's gonna be about the twister, and my screen's really dusty right now, so um, I'm pretty irritated right now. But whatever. Um, so let's go. So first, you wanna of course have something, something that you wanna import, import something. So, so hang on. Let, let me just look for a good clip. All right. Um, I'm just looking for something. Um, okay, that concussion ninja looks fine. Um, I think I'm, yes, alright. Let's import all the shit. Okay. So, yes. Now, the second thing we need is music, so let's go here. Uh,. Look, let's look up that. What the f Oh. Sorry, I spelled it wrong. No, this song's not that good, so. Okay, that, that one is pretty good, so, uh, okay, now we have songs, so, now we have to put the clip in there, which I hope everybody knows how to do, um, I'm just gonna set, like, an intro for this video, I'll just take this part here, hang on, um, so this is, of course, gonna be a tutorial, so, this thingy will be done slow motion, put it like that. How long do I want it to be like? Just short, not that long. Uh, as you can see, if you look at this, it's like slow-mo, but that's not Twixter. So if you want to get Twix, if you want to Twixter this, then you have to go here, go here, to Widow Quality and Optical Flow. Click on that. Now, it'll start analyzing optical flow onto it and you, as you can see this thingy right here when it goes to 100 percent then it, that means it's done sort of like rendering the um, twixter onto it so okay now it's 100 percent and let's see it's the final cut pro twixter there's a trick to get like better twixter for final cut pro but uh, I'll show you, I'm about to show you that. Um, this is just the normal Twixter, and some of you might know the Final Cut Pro Twixter isn't the most, isn't really the best Twixter ever, I would say. So hang on, let me do this. Okay, preview screen load up. This is my concussion ninja, which uh, you might know that that was in my montage. So let's just have it like this. So let me just play the clip. All right, so that's the clip. Now, where do we want Twixter? Right, let me show you the Final Cut Pro Twixter, first of all. Now, let me go to a spot where I want it to. Hang on, we are just gonna get the blade tool here. That, and Twixter it down here. All right, that seems good. Select that. Slow it down like 50% or so. Oh, no, more, more. Uh, 25%? No, that's too short. 10%. Okay, that's... Okay, so... 
I'll just show you cause, um, how the Final Cut Pro Twister looks like. And again, it's now got to render it. Hang on. Alright. It's got to render that. Why is it taking so long? Like, I just rendered a bigger pit and it, bit, and it took like... Like what five seconds to render and then this bit takes like yeah see there's the um final cut pro logic here it's really logic man what the f all right whatever i'm not, I'm not bothered by it so so yeah i might have to cut this bit off Okay, so it's finally done rendering. Took like, oh, what, what, what? Oh, okay. <laughs> it's finally done rendering, and it took like quite a while to render. I would say, took like ten or five minutes. Not exactly counting the time, so I don't really know. But um, so here is the FCP Twixer. So let me just show you. You saw how sh** that was, didn't you? That was just messed up, I mean. Like, what the f***? Um, well, there's a way to f sort of fix that. And, um, let me just show you. I'm just gonna make, like, a little space here. Hang on, just a little black space. So, hang on. So, I need to. Alright. Well, I'm gonna get the same clip here. And. Now, here is going to. Now, I will be showing you the trick that I use personally. This is. A. What's it really? Pretty damn good trick. Alright, you select that little bit. Alright, you see that? Now, what you do is put 10%. And now you're gonna drag it all the way to 1%, like as slow as possible. What you're gonna do now is you're gonna. What the f did I do? Oh, sh Okay, that's fixed. Um, you want to just have it for a few seconds, like, I guess up till there. So, up till there, okay. Now what you do is you're going to delete this. And you can probably guess what we're going to do now. We're going to select this. You're going to go here and optical flow. And this is, will ch totally change it. Well, did at least last time. What the hell? What the hell? Hang on. Is it? You'll you'll see in a second. Okay. This hopefully hopefully should be better. So. Okay. So that wasn't that good either, but. Like, you gotta select a really small bit, and then do it on that. It'll look a lot better. So, this is what I did on my montage. That's what I did. I, like, cut it up, but you gotta select the smaller piece, and that's what makes it look better, sort of. Right. Now... I guess we just want to, you know, add a title. I mean, ooh, where's knockout or whatever? Knockout, yeah, there it is. Knockout, you want to, so that it's uh, like that. Doing anything, not doing anything. Hang on, oh, 
Okay, there we go. Um, Twixter. Twixter test. Um, no, actually. Twixter tutorial. Alright. Yeah, now you want to like have it as a different font. I guess. You shouldn't change the like style of it because then it's sort of it's gonna look a bit messy, so what the hell? What the fun is this? Hang on. Alright, it keeps on going to that, so don't know why. Let's just use that font, so you know put it a bit up like that. Now that'll go away there. And just for the fun of it, I want to do a small correction. Actually, no, you know, um, I'm going to show color correction in another video, but whatever, I'll show you that little thing later, I'm not going to show it here on this video, so, oh, stupid, okay, yeah, stupid, okay, you're going to select the bit that you want, let's say we select this bit here, oh, sh I want that bit here, yeah. oh, come on, like, Cut it up like that. And just to make it smooth, you want to do that. That's what I always do in my montages. Alright, so it's a bit loud, so I'm just going to play the clip, okay? There. Let it render. Because then it's going to mess up the Twixter, which happened... In a few parts of my dual touch we went in, you probably might have noticed with the sniper when I was um, reloading it, it had a pretty weird sort of bug. It does bug when you don't let it render, which I did not because I don't have patience to let it render for like the whole day, so you know. Alright, I'm going to play the clip now, so. Alright, so that was the clip, uh, there is like color correction and a lot of stuff in Final Cut Pro which I will show in another tutorial, but that is basically how you get Twixter, there's not a Twixter Twixter, like a Twixter tool, but like Optical Flow is pretty much Twixter, so Final Cut Pro doesn't actually have like the proper sort of Twixter, but it's like optical flow in Final Cut Pro, so yeah, hope you enjoyed this tutorial, and um, for the fun of it, I'm just going to play the clip again, because why not?